All right, so you guys said you wanted a video of me moving. I kind of just woke up here. Um, you said you wanted a video of me moving into my new house, so I figured I would go ahead and give you guys a little bit of a tour. I'm not gonna go like all over the place, but um, I will show you a few things. I'll show you my backyard. We'll show you what's going to be the new cash room. We definitely need to get the, the new cash room into the, into the channel show you what it's gonna be like. I don't know how I'm gonna fit all of these uh, these phones, 100 different smartphones into this bedroom, but by God, I'm gonna do it somehow, so. But I figured I'd show you guys that I have. I moved out of an apartment into a house, so, you know, it's uh, it's been a little bit of a struggle, but I wanna stress this to you guys. Phone farming, mining Bitcoin, has definitely taken my life and made it a bit better. Now, it's not like I, I have the, the nicest house in the world here. It's not like super nice, but you can see that I've got, I've got things better than what I did have them, but I have a designated area that I'm going to have to have as my cash room, so I'm trying to figure out how it's gonna work out here. But you can see I got one of my TVs mounted. I got some phones that I'm starting to unpack here. And I've got some wall space, so we're going to have to figure out how to get these phones set up exactly where they need to be on the walls. So it's going to take me a little time to get really, really situated. I've got my, my phone here on this, this tripod stand, which also serves as like a selfie stick. So the camera is still just a little wobbly. I might consider investing in a new one. But yeah, guys, I've, I, I've moved, so... We have some other things that we'll talk about here in this video. I kind of want to talk about the price of Bitcoin and how it is, it's finally going back up. We, I'm going to shoot it over to the screen of my computer and we'll take a, a look at a few things over on the computer and I'll see you guys there. Have you been looking for easy ways to make money online? Welcome to eCash Society. Bitcoin talk, mining rig tutorials, and paying smartphone applications all in one location. Alright, so normally I'm not one to sit here and show off. I don't really do that, but I, I did I had a couple of people ask me about, you know, me moving into my house. They wanted to see me moving all of my entire setup uh from my apartment that I was at over to the house that I moved into. You guys wanted to check out my setup. So I put that little segment at the beginning just for you guys. There's a couple of things I want to talk about today though in this video. One, we're going to go over here to Amazon.com, and I think this is it, guys. I think this is where the graphics cards, the prices of these are going to go back to, like, a normal kind of price range. We had GTX 1080 Ti's were sitting at, and they're still high. Don't, don't get me wrong. This is They're not back at their normal values just yet, but I have noticed that you will see that there's a few cars that are going down by right around like a hundred dollars from their original price point. If you look over here, Nvidia GeForce GTX 1080 Ti Founders Edition 12 1200. It's I mean it's still steep, but they have dropped down from like the thirteen hundred dollar price range that they were at. This is ungodly expensive. It's GTX 1080 Ti FTW3 DT Gaming 11 gigabyte GDDR 5x, but sixteen hundred and ninety nine dollars i mean what what is really going on but the one thing that i want to point out is if you look at asus rog strix geforce gtx 1080 ti 11 gigabyte vr ready this was a lot more expensive than than what it used to be so i feel like guys this is it this is where the graphics cards are going to go back to like a normal price point they're going to get in a decent area as far as like being able to purchase a few more but the question still needs to be called into play here as to whether mining, if we don't see the price of Bitcoin go up higher, is mining still going to be profitable within the first, let's just say the first 
increment of this year. So the first portion of the first four months, maybe what what's going to happen with mining over the next few months. So I think that this is information that definitely needs to be covered, though. I want to look at one other thing, though. And guys, this video is not going to be anything that I mean, it, it could be a fundamental use to you if you're trying to get into mining right now. It could be of some use if you're about to purchase some graphics cards. I think this is the time period that you guys would want to wait just a little longer. Give it a month. Give it over the course of this month to see what happens with these graphics cards. Maybe even give it another month on top of that because these cards may go down so, so far. Uh, but we can see here that Bitcoin is actually getting back towards a, 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 at least a better range than what it was if you look at Boop. See this little bump here? This is the happiest bump I've ever seen in my life. So we are we have went back up. I believe it's back up 15%. If I come over here to Coinbase on my phone, let's double check that because I don't want to get the incorrect information here on my channel. Um, so, okay, so it's like we've had a little bit of a downward spiral. Right now we're sitting at, it's, it's up $385, so that's 5.38%. And it seemed like I saw that it was up 15% at, at one point throughout this day. But 5.38% is really, that's much better. I'd like to see it go up 10%. That's my overall goal. Guys, I just really wanted to do this as like a quick video to talk about just a couple of things going on with cryptocurrencies. I have another phone farming review that I'm about to, for an application that I'm about to put up here on the channel. But I wanted to share some of this information with you and my thoughts and what's going to happen with with uh, the graphics cards and mining scenario here within the first half of this year, what people should do. I think now is still a great time to buy some Bitcoin. I think we are going to see an upward trend from this point forward. It's going to keep going up in value. Um, I, dish, I did just have a stream that covered a lot of this, but I did not get to show you guys uh, basically my, my new home here. So um, guys, you definitely want to like and subscribe to my channel. There's a lot of really amazing things that are along the way. We're going to start doing a few more streams. I'm working on getting my setup here all situated the way it needs to be so we can we can basically do some more interesting videos here. You guys know that I got my green screen, so interesting things are happening along the way with that. But yeah, I will see you in the next video, and uh, definitely like and subscribe.